guys subscribers how's it going I painted my nails and they look all pretty um, so I want to do a what's in my frick what's in my pencil case <laughs> what's in my pencil case video and I think it'd be fun I actually have a couple because that's the kind of person I am but yeah I'll show it off right now so this is my camo one um, it holds all my colored things. I used to have a compass. I guess it's on the other side. Yeah, but I gave it to my sister. So this side has a trusty pencil sharpener. And then all of my colored pencils. And they're Crayola. Because I really like Crayola. And these are not all of them. I have a lot of doubles. But I like them. Um, I'm trying to get into colored pencils. A lot more because it's my favorite uh, medium to work with or at least the one I'm best at so there's that and on this side I've got all my inky stuff so I've got these sergeant uh, brush tip markers and I like them because they don't bleed and they work really well I've got these papermate flare M and I really, really like these. I think they're really great for writing and for coloring and just using in general. I love these. I always want to have some of these. This one's one of my favorites, actually. Um, so I've got two packs of these, and they come in like five, and then hashtag coloring. And they've got a brush tip and a nib. I've used this a lot, if you cannot tell. In. Okay, and then the nib. And I like them. I really like greens. And I've got brush marker in Winsor Newton. I've got the brush and the chisel, which is just our, you know, regular chisel. And then I've got sharpies. I've got a bunch of different sharpies, and they're just, I've just got a lot of them, and yeah, I like them. They work well. And I've got a lot of like earth tone stuff in there. Yeah, that's what's in here. So this is something I got at like the dollar store or something a little while back. And it holds all my pencil stuff. So I've got all my refills. And I actually have colored lead. This was kind of tricky to find, but I really, really like it. And I've got regular refills, um, just point seven. Okay, I deleted a video, so, um, I don't know. I've got this. It's just a long eraser. It's wiggly. And I like it. I got it, like, a two-pack for pretty cheap. I've got my pink. You can see it's pink. Um, orange and purple. And then this is just regular. And then, yeah, I just keep it in here. It's easy to carry. And it's nice and small because it doesn't well, it doesn't need to be big. So yeah, I got that. So this is cool. So I got a bunch of these cases and then I decided I was gonna put my friction pens in. Which okay, don't zoom. Come on, come on camera. There it goes. Got these friction colors and Japanese-ish. And I've got just like this nice nib. And then, oh, there it is. And then an eraser. And it uses friction to erase, so that's super nice. And I like using them. And re re refocus. There it goes. And while I was in California, I picked up this, which is lavender purple. And it's really pretty, and this is like the only chisel. But I love them. And then I have some pens as well. And they all just kind of go in here. And it's super great. Next I have this other one. And it has my black sticky notes on it. But uh, this is where I keep some washi tapes. So that I can just grab and go. And I have like these. Which I made myself. Which is just cutting paper out. And putting double sided tape on. 
and then putting them on parchment paper so they don't stick to everything. But I've got some I got some cute ones. A lot of these are plant-based ones because I really, really like plant-based. And there's a lot of cacti ones. And then there's some cute thin ones and stuff. And there's just an easy to grab one. So this one's already open, but it's um, metal. It's super easy. And this is my ink one. I do have a pencil in there, and then two of my Prismas in. Copenhagen blue, and then crimson red. And I'll pull them all out as well. I've got these two sticky notes that I got at the dollar section of Target a while ago. I'm not great at using these, but they're cute. I got this in California. as cute little cats, and they're so cute, and I love them. I've got an RSPV, RSPV, RSVP, there we go, pen in red, and these are my favorite, I actually have another one in blue, right here, and you can get like a two pack for a dollar, or 97 cents, and I, these are my favorite pen brands, it's just my favorite, I love them, and I've got this, this is my first ink pen I have ever bought, and it's just a cute little brush, and I've had it for a while, and I love it. This is a black paper mate friction. It's the same, and I keep it in there because it's good for inking and drawing and stuff. This is a fountain pen. I got it like, oh my gosh, I got it a while ago <laughs> from a teacher. Um, he had a big pack, and he gave me one because he knows I really like writing. And he was a decent teacher. Anyway, I've got that. So this is my Tombow marker. It's the only Tombow I have, and I love it. And it's just a super fine brush nib one. I don't think it's an actual brush, but it's like a brush, like, you know, bristles. It's like one. And then this is my gold Sharpie. I really like my gold sharpie. It shows up really well on my black post-its. And then these I got a little while ago for inking. And I've got point... They line up really well like this, but I've got like uh, point 0.2, point 0.25, point 0.35, point 0.45, and 0.65. But they're just simple little pointies like that. See, here's the 6.5. This one's really big. So, yeah. I just, dang it. <laughs> and then I've got a pink pencil. I bought some pencils. And this is a Zig pen. I haven't actually used it yet. But it's nice. And then I've got my ink thing. I really like it. Um, you saw me buy it, like unbox it. And I really like it. I think it works really well. So I have it. And then I just kind of try to put them all back. Boom. Video magic. And then I've got post-it notes. And these I actually use in my animation notebook to help tell me like where new ones are. Specifically these ones tell me when a new project starts. And then these are for like little notes. I've already used them. And then I just go boop, boop, boop. 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 And then it closes. And I really like the metal aesthetic of it. I really like it. It's amazing. This is my paint bag. It's got um, two zippers. I got this in California as well. I got it at like um, a Japanese dollar store where everything's like $1.50. I've got my paints. And it, this is really cool because it's waterproof. Um, I've got my paints. The lid to this one come off. came off got my small, medium, large brush sets, um, another RSVP pen, which they're not waterproof, and then a pen pencil and eraser, and a couple brushes, and these all go in one pocket, and then my papers go in this one. So this is a little notebook I made. It's watercolor paper, and then I just redid the binding and put a piece of washi tape on it. So that way it was just 
just easier and nicer. And I've got other little papers that I just keep in there. That way, um, I can carry them around with me. And I don't have to worry about them getting water damaged. And then this is my, this is cool, this is my gouache. It'll open. And look how nice that is. Oh no. I don't know if it's just my paints. But they like to like come out randomly and that's no fun. But yeah. As you can see from my white, it's all gross. And that one's like my favorite purple. It's like a pink purple. Anyway. All in a nice little Optoids pin. Easy to carry and move around. And then, boom. Yeah. So a little thing, but yeah. So this is my bullet journal. I made it like, I put it in yesterday because it was the first of August and now it's the second. And uh, I've got my, this is another Zig. And it's like a cute little ink well. The annoying thing is all of this ink it just moves really easy so that means it's not all in the well to be used but I still love it and I've got my purple which is one of my favorites and then my blue RSVP one that's just in there and then in here I've got a little binder clip a couple more washi tapes a mini pair of scissors, which are over there and too far from your reach. So that's what's usually in here. And then, yeah, I just keep it on there. And I've got these, which I like to carry around. And I have plans for these, but I have not completed the plans for them. And then this is my travel journal. And I made this. Isn't it pretty? And that way it would be easier for me to carry around and to move. And I used to have this just tucked under here, but it's not. So what can you do? But ah, it's so pretty and I made it. And then these are the notebooks I made. If you're interested in buying one, let me know. I've got a story one, drawings, and just random notes. Yeah, and it just, boop, super easy, and yeah, that's it. And here's the, the thing on my water bottle that I like to carry with me, and my pretty sticker. So, thanks for watching, subscribe for more quality content, and let's see if I can get up to 100 subscribers, because I have a plan for that, that I will show you in, uh, uh. I should have a video up about in a little while, but thanks for watching.